<laughs> What's up, modern steaders? We're gonna turn this old dilapidated pop-up camper into a mobile chicken coop. First thing we gotta do is start tearing it apart. She's in a lot worse shape than I thought she was. So, let's have some fun. So we got the top pot all taken off. That's in the back of the truck to go to the dump. <laughs> so I'm out here just tearing apart the camper. And I've lost my pocket knife quite a while ago. So I've been using my little crafty thing. And I'm over here just walking, bringing some junk to my truck. And look what I just came across. See that? <laughs> look at that. A little dirty. But other than that, she's in great shape. Going back in my pocket. Thing's been out here for a good six months. First hour or two of tearing apart the camper. First load to the dump. And that's what the camper looks like. Soon to be our mobile chicken coop. Woohoo! This is pretty neat. I don't know if I can save it and do something with it, but little three burner propane cook stove. We're gonna be making an outdoor kitchen here. And I'm thinking that little cooktop might go nice in the outdoor kitchen. So that's kind of a score. Maybe we can use the sink there and I don't So I got most of the trailer all taken apart and thrown away. We just have the decking left. It's being a real pain to get off. I took the linoleum floor off and the rest of the bit, the paper backing and the glue are stuck. So I let it sit out in the rain overnight. So hopefully I can peel off, yes sir, the backing. Some nasty glue. Let me show you why. It's screwed down right to the metal frame of the trailer. I don't think I took any pictures or any videos, but I had the whole trailer up on its side, held up with a little tractor, trying to get in there and see another way of, of how I could get the plywood off, but it wasn't coming. So we're gonna try this attempt, unscrewing it all, and I'll keep you guys posted. Now the screws we couldn't get out of the plywood because they were too rusted up. Just been using my hole saw bit and auging them out right around. We're using the battery operated one. We just overheated it. So now we're gonna go to our big angle drill. It might not look like much, but modern steaders, that is the start to our mobile chicken coop. Woohoo! More to come. Thanks guys for watching. I hope you liked it. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down in the comments below. Give the video a thumbs up if you liked it. Share the video, it really helps. And we'll see you right back here tomorrow, guys. Well, we're always trying to challenge the status quo, and we challenge you to do the same.